Task 5 Writing a user friendly or interactive program. So, when an input statement is encountered, a blinking cursor appears on the input output screen, indicating that the computer is waiting for input. For example, if I execute this program, I get a blinking cursor here. This means that computer is waiting for data. But if I am not a programmer, then I will have no ability to know that what it is expecting from me. So this technique is not very useful, though it works properly, it is not very useful. So this program works fine, but I am not able to find out what is the expected input required by the program. So when input statement is encountered, I know that I get a blinking cursor. This simply indicates that computer is waiting for data. User expects the program to clearly state what it wants as input. So this is what is the expectation of user. So programmer can satisfy that expectation by incorporating a prompt. So this is achieved easily by writing a statement to output appropriate message. This message is called as a prompt just before the read statement. So the message should be message should be displayed just before the read statement. This technique is called as prompting the user for input. So I can modify the previous program so that it displays a prompt just before input. So here I can enter a new statement. I can write a output statement. So I have to output a message and therefore I have to write output statement. And whatever I type here, enclosed in parenthesis, will be displayed as it is. So I have entered this text here. Now I will save the program and then I will execute the program. You should remember, just before input statement, there is an output statement. So I get this output first and then computer waits for data. So if I execute this program, I get input output screen like this. So here I get a prompt. Now I know that computer is expecting value of radius or value of r from me. I can type value of r and I get output like this. So this program is a interactive program which prompts the user for data and then executes the program based on the data entered. So this program is very easy for the user.